Welcome to In The Nets here at Lords. A real treat for you today. Uh, we're gonna find someone who is not just a social media personality, he is also a stand-up comedian. He's also actually even run for mayor, would you believe? Um, he is sensational on YouTube. You've gotta go and check him out. I'm gonna meet him today. Let's go and see Max Fosh. What's in the bag today at the end What's at, at Lords? It was a baguette. Rank long hop coming up. It. Well done, Mummy. She went to Waitrose. Oh! oh I, like that. I like that. That was nice. We started off well, but I think our mystery batter has um, really found his feet quite quickly. Oh, don't do that, Matt. <laughs> because posh boys cannot be. Uh, can't be trusted. <laughs> they cannot be trusted when they're next to each other. What? Oh, I don't know. Are you so well, deep? Like Welcome Hello. to the Indoor Nets here at Lords. Thank you very much. You so like it here? What a space. You like it here? Well, I, absolutely. And I've, I've, I've spent a lot of time in here over the years. I've heard. Yes. How, so just give us a little bit of background. You've actually played at Lords a couple of times, is that yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So my background in cricket, my dad was a professional player. Played for Essex in the 70s. Wow. He opened the batting. Um, and so when I was younger, that's all I wanted to be. I wanted to be a professional cricketer. Yeah. Um, and so played through the age groups. I lived not too far away from here. So yeah. played in Regency Park around the corner. And we'd have yeah. the winter indoor nets in here, yeah. just on that side, where it seems like the next generation, we've got to say it, yeah. uh, 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 throwing a bat and ball around. Yeah. Um, and then I, I went to a rather posh school called Harrow and played in the Harrow Eaton match, which is, I think it's the oldest cricket fixture in the world. Yeah. But a better fact, it's the only cricket fixture in the world where the two fans are separated. <laughs> <laughs> because posh boys cannot be... Uh, can't be trusted. <laughs> they cannot be trusted when they're next to each other. Um, so yeah, I played two years, won one, lost one. Yeah, and then really that was in 2013. Runs, runs wickets? No, I batted 11 and I bowled 16 overs over two years and didn't get a single wicket. Uh, I caught a catch though. There you go. Uh, there, there we go. go. Um, and so yeah, I've, uh, it's, it's nice to be back. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Your career has just taken off in recent years. You, I was just... I was trying to describe you as a social media personality, a stand-up comedian, yeah. politician. Pol <laughs> no? My politician days, I'm a disgraced politician, as we <laughs> said. Um, yeah, no, I make YouTube videos predominantly, and my whole thing, my whole shtick is just doing the silliest things that I can think of. Um, so, What is the silliest thing you've done? Um, well, last week um, I hired 11 bald men to sit in the Lion King at the theatre and I wrote Mufasa dies on each each individual head as a bit of a spoiler for my mate who was going. I think um, it's for anyone else who's yeah. watching right <laughs> Yeah, I'm so sorry. If, it's 30 years old, guys. Um, so what else have I done? I've run for London Mayor. That was um, what I wanted to ask you yes. about. How, how'd you get on with that? Um, I came 19th out of 20. Uh, not bad considering my main manifesto point was don't vote for me. <laughs> um, so coming 19th was, was quite a shock for everybody. Um, but that was just, that was during 2020 when I realized, oh, actually it's, you don't have to do that much in order to put your name into the proverbial hat. Um, and it was, it was great. It was an experience as to how, to how the electoral process goes. I really wanted to try and engage younger people to vote, not for me, but just for anybody. Which is important, actually. Yeah, yeah I yeah, thought, yeah, okay, because often yeah. young people, when it comes to voting, it's... Disillusioned. They're disillusioned. They're being yeah, told yeah. by someone who's a lot older, oh, you, it's very important to vote. But if yeah. they had kind of a horse in the, horse in the game, um, then it kind of... And I, I think it did work. We had, there was other YouTuber, um, Nicole Milano, who also ran. I saw, yeah. And yeah. it kind of was the only thing that, that kind of teenagers were talking about. Growing up with the father who's a professional cricketer, obviously that yeah. was your first introduction to the game. Yes. Is that where your passion started? Or was it yeah, something yeah, you saw yeah. on TV or you picked up a bat somewhere? Yeah, I we, we had a garden. It's like every kind of young boy or girl is kind of playing cricket for the first time in the, in the garden or at the local park and just picking up a bat and just hitting a ball yeah. with, with the blue stumps behind you. And like, God, this is, this is great. Um, and then actually coming to Lords for uh, uh, an England test match. And I remember I was down in the mound stand. I think it was the mound stand and Simon Jones was fielding at fine leg and he turned, walked back towards the, uh, the boundary and I waved at him and he just looked at me and winked and like five-year-old Max was like, oh my God, this is amazing. The envy of thousands uh, yeah, of adults around the world. He probably wasn't even winking at me, he was probably saying hello to somebody else. But, um, and then that game, I managed to convince my dad to take me to the, the shop and I got my first ever bat, which was a yellow GM. Yeah. Um, and it was kind of from there. I don't know why I was so interested in batting because I batted 11 for my entire school career. Yeah. Um, and I was, a, I was a left arm spinner. Love that. When it came to any cricketing idols, any, any heroes in particular, who's that? 
Daniel Vittori. Yeah. He was a left arm spinner and he had glasses. Um, <laughs> but who else did I really like? Obviously, like KP and the 2005 Ashes, all of those, yeah. all of those guys. Yeah. Um, I was a big fan of Kasperwitz for a bit because of him gloving down the leg sign to, to, <laughs> to, to, to James behind the stars. I was like, yes. Him, then. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> when it came to, you know, sledging as a kid? Yes. Did it used to be, are you the best cricketer in your family? No, it's your dad. Was, was it any of, any of that sort of stuff? It was a lot of that going on. Um, it was it was a lot of umpires because I, um, I went, as I said, I went to Harrow and all the umpires had just like in the, the private school circuit, they'd yeah. just been the same. And so whenever it was like bowlers names, it would always be, excuse me, sir, relation to Matthew Fosh. So, <laughs> yes, he's my dad. Ooh, fantastic player. Anyway, please play. So like as I'm about to bowl, I'm yeah. thinking, yeah, great. Thanks, dad. Um, so uh, it, more from the sledging, more came from the umpires than anybody else. Yeah, fair. If there was a side um, that you could have been a part of yeah which would have been so I'm talking in history you could talk about the great West Indies teams from the 70s yeah, yeah, and 80s yeah, yeah. you could talk about that like all conquering Australian team from the 90s and noughties yeah maybe the current England team who are just playing a different brand of cricket we've never seen before is there a particular era generation or a particular country that you would have thought well, I'd love to have been a part of that dressing room I really want to be part of the you know the European cricket dressing room is it Estonia <laughs> um, with the guy who's have you been watching yeah someone? absolutely I want to be part of that dressing room I think room. they're playing on carpet like this don't yeah they, a lot of their I games. love it yeah. Um, I think, but also being in the Ashes team when Cook just turned up and was scoring runs for fun. Down under? Down under. Being yeah. in that dressing room would have just been a lot of fun because it was almost kind of sniggering and joking as he went out to bat knowing he was about to double turn up. Max is familiar to some of you guys who follow our TikTok channel, At Home of Cricket. Yeah. You've done some fun videos. Yes. Um, today, the joke's not going to be on you. No, but we're gonna have some, <laughs> it might be. We're going to have some fun though, watching you bowl today. Uh, are you prepared? Are you ready? I haven't, I haven't bowled since... When was the since, last time you turned your arm over? Yeah, 2017, I think, in a charity game. So, um, <laughs> left arm, dibbly dobblies, moving away from the batsman if they're right hand. Uh, let's give it a go. It's fine, okay, cool. Uh, we're going to get the lesson on with Max and uh, we're going to have uh, someone for you to bowl at as well, yeah. who I've heard is quite handy. Yeah, he's a bit of a gun, I've heard. Okay, Absolute cool. gun. Right, let's get going. All right, Max, looking sharp, nice and loose on your toes, fielders. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh, that's all right, that's all right. I've got two out there for you. No. Yeah, okay. If he's driving, I'm happy if he's driving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A bit more air, a bit more air. A bit more air. A bit more air. I like it, I like it. Oh, don't do that, Bat. I have a feeling he's going to like to get on the back foot here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's pin him. Oh! oh I got like it. that. I like that. <laughs> Very impressive. There you go. There you go, Skip. I'm going to give you a little touch for that one. That was quality. That was good. Got it! <laughs> He did, he, he did help by coming down the track on the third ball. I think, ball, I think but he goaded him. I think the sledging just, it was just too much let's see if he, let's see if he, let's see if he's, let's see if he's annoyed now or he, yeah, he blocks yeah. up. Mind the windows. Ooh! Has he hit the, has he hit the ground? No, nah, I think that's... He scuffed the ground. Ooh, Ooh yeah, well played. <laughs> That's, that's my fault. That's, that's my run. fault. That's, <laughs> that's also my fault as well. Because <laughs> that is, uh, that's, yeah. that's the juicy half volley outside yeah, off yeah. quite a long way. Oh, he, li he likes it there, doesn't he? He does, yeah. Let's put another player out there then. It does feel like he's just going to be milking ones. <laughs> just push it out there. But I guess that's, that's why we need to keep as a, as a well, lovely... What do you like as a bowler? When you play, yeah. are, you, are you talking a lot to your fielders in your... In your no, I level? mean, as you've probably seen just here, <laughs> I, I would always love to get through my balls as quick as possible. Yeah, yeah. And actually that's something that I've just obviously just brought into the filming process because <laughs> I, for me it was all about like rhythm and like hurrying the batsman yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I wouldn't, I didn't have that much like a variation in my locker, yeah, but yeah. I was, if I was on a good line, a good length, yeah, I would almost kind of feel like Ah, uh, let's not ruin it. I'm in a flow right now. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Um, no, I was I was pretty quiet. Yeah. I would appeal for everything, <laughs> um, almost to the point where umpires nearly started not giving me things not just out of things. spite. Yeah. But uh, yeah, it's normally quick, fast. Let's get the over done. Yeah, nice, nice. Oh, that was in Bearborn. Yeah. Okay? I think I think he likes it off back and front foot. He's, he's, 
He likes it off backhand yeah, front foot. Yeah, he's difficult so to he's play. A good player. He's a good player, yeah. I think he's quite difficult to play against. But, um, Absolutely. But I think that the success you had is with the drift and the um, and the air outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like, kill him with the flight, kill him with the flight, kill him with the flight. Really push this on up. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, he's a good player though, isn't he? He's quick on his feet. <laughs> would you give him the warning chat? No, I would pretend, I was told by a coach when I was younger, that pretend that every ball is intentional. So even if they hit you for six, smile, like give it a bit of a nod, yeah. don't kind of turn around, scuff the foot, like, don't have one of these, <laughs> um, because then they know you've got, you got to them. So make them feel like it's it's in your plan at yeah, all yeah, times. Yeah. So that was, that was what I uh, I tended to do. All right, cool. Okay, right, let's right, keep right. going. You got this, you got this. He started off well, but I think our mystery batter has um, really found his feet <laughs> quite quickly. Ah, not good, not good. I've yeah. just been given this GoPro to strap on my chest, <laughs> and it's going to get it's going to be max chest cam. Yeah, I like um, that. I like but that. no, I'm feeling good. Uh, we, we need wickets though, so I'm thinking right. I give you an over to get a wicket. Otherwise, I'm going to have to. Take me off. That's sling, fair enough. Sling your hook. That's fair enough. Is that okay? okay. All right. So six balls are the best. You need, the you best need Max Fosh we can possibly have here. Okay, right. Yes. No yes, pressure yeah. though. No I'll pressure. Get, I'll get you no a pressure. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Left arm round coming through. All right, Max, you got this. Six balls. First up. It's a dot. Yes, yeah, a dot. It's a dot. I need you to build pressure though. It's a dot, I need, yeah. I, need I pressure. do need pressure. It needs to be, it needs to yeah. be pitched build up a little Build pressure, bit. build that pressure. Absolutely. You got him with the flight earlier, yeah. so maybe that's where you need to go. Or just some rank long hop, which he's miscues. Rank long hop coming up. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's, that's, that's good. That's good. That's oh. good. That's good. Just, sorry, I need to pitch it up. I'm currently, I'm currently coming off, which is not a good sign. Yeah, he's got four balls. Yeah. Four balls left to survive. What? Ooh, What's up? I don't know. He was so Where deep. He was so deep, though, because I had to put him out on the boundary, so. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, he's absolutely nailed that. <laughs> that's just a good shot. <laughs> That is just an absolute. I, I, I think you need him as wide outside his off stump as possible. Far wide as possible. Well, I haven't done. Yeah, scared. I haven't, haven't brought out the arm ball. There you go. I'm there you do go. One arm ball. The best tool last. The Here arm we ball. go. Oh! Is that okay. Don't 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 check the front yeah. foot. But no, we're not checking front foot. There's no technology. That here was, that's close. We've got one ball left here at Lords today. Ball. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? It's just gotta be flighted. Yeah. Like hell. Loads of air. Loads of air. Nice and wide. Stand on that front foot and then yeah. rag as much as I can. Yeah. All so right. yeah. Let's I'll do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Oh. Shot. Max. Nearly. Well done. Quality. Thank you very much, Skip. Started off well, but then he found his feet. Yeah, he's, but, um, he's a good player, a mystery but, batsman. But to be honest, though, you've got great rhythm. Thanks, mate. Because you really haven't bowled in quite a while. You had some great rhythm time. today. So, yeah, if it doesn't, doesn't take long to kind good of get back It takes out of you a little bit, though. It does, yeah. I shouldn't be sweating as much. I'm on left arm spin. I'm not, I'm not <laughs> Jimmy Anderson, for Christ's sake. Um, so, no, but great opportunity. Loved, loved coming back here. Yeah, so, yeah. thanks for having me. Uh, can we get you back here, book you into Absolutely. a net, and, uh, and then try you against uh, a different type? Well, we need a right-hander. We need to book you in with a right-hander. I'm not, I'm lefty. Oh, <laughs> right, any right-handers? <laughs> uh, we'll get you a right-hander and then we'll get Max here back at Lords. Max Fosh, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Uh, we shall speak to you soon.